And now, your Precision 18 forecast. News 18. Weather from where you live. Well, there's our clipper system with a lot of snow falling from western Ohio all the way to Iowa. Embedded in this are bands of heavier snow as some of the warm air tries to move northward. But with that, it's very interesting. As some of the warm, more moist air moves overhead, about 10,000 feet or so, 8, 10,000 feet, what it's doing is it's causing the snowflakes to kind of clump up together a little bit more because it's warmer and there's more moisture. So, uh, with that said, the flakes are getting larger. They were kind of grainy and just kind of pouring snow at first. Now we've got these huge flakes called dendrites, and that's a sign of what's happening upstairs, the warmer, uh, more moist air coming in. And these are big flakes from Crawfordsville and through Lennon and Frankfurt, some bands of moderate to heavy snow. Also band of pretty heavy snow here uh, right through Delphi and also Battleground and around Brookston, other widespread snow, Winnemac, Rochester, pretty heavy snow around Logansport right now. Another bands of snow here in central Illinois. These are all working to the southeast, the back edge at the Mississippi River. So three to five inches over a good chunk of the area, one to three far, far northeast, one to three in the far southwest, but three to five, very common, three, four, four and a half inch amounts, pretty widespread. But there will be a zone here from near uh, just northeast to Attica. Uh, south side Lafayette, down towards uh, Romney and Linden and south of Frankfurt, that may see a, a couple, maybe three amounts of, say, 5.2, 5.5, 5.8 inches of snow right in this zone. That's the zone that has the best chance of that. Here we are at 1130. There are the bands of snow still in the air. Even at 1230, it's still snowing and snowing at 3 o'clock in the morning. But then by 5 a.m., this jets on out, and it's just a mostly cloudy a cloudy Friday with temperature rising to 28 with not much winds. So we'll actually feel pretty good after a morning low of 14. So temperatures will be rising tonight. Patches of freezing drizzle Saturday morning, but a couple patches of freezing dri uh, uh, patches of just plain drizzle Saturday evening. Otherwise, just kind of a gray day, but warming up 40 by 5 p.m. So everybody's car is covered in nastiness, salt. Sand, dirt, not a good day to wash the car tomorrow. But Saturday will be better, not necessarily a wax day. But boy, if you're going to wash the car and wax it, Sunday is a great day to do it. And with this changing weather, our app, our WLFI app and Chad's blog, I just updated it. I'm going to keep updating it tonight with snowfall totals from our area spotters. 53 Sunday with a mix of clouds and some sunshine with a few patches of drizzle early, and then maybe again late in the evening, rainy Monday, 58, breezy Tuesday, and then rain, maybe ending as a little snow Wednesday, 42 that falling, then it's much colder after that, and we'll get into a colder, snowier pattern. It's nice not to see any negatives on it. It is great, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Thank you, Chad. Okay. Producer.